Okay, everybody, so I thought I would start our video with the entrance to our apartment. We're on the third floor, and you can take the stairs, or there is the world's tiniest lift. Let's see if I can get it here and open it and show you. I'm not too good at this video thing. Maybe I'll get better as I do this more often. Okay, here comes the lift. All right, so it's coming. All right, so that just opens and then there is the little tiny two person lift. When we got here, we had to send our suitcases up in shifts. Okay, so there's the staircase coming up. The walls are painted these very fun green and blue stripes. And here is our front door to our apartment. And now I am inside. There's the entry hallway with Dave sitting down there doing something on the computer. Some things never change. Okay, and just as you come in, there's a little phone thing like they have in New York so people can buzz us if they want to come in. And then this is Sticky Door. This is our guest bedroom. Okay, small, but it's got a desk and twin bed. And this is going to be kind of our storage place, I think. Um, there's one of our suitcases. We've got a chair. This is what you use when you're going to the grocery store for more than a couple of things. It's a nice little wheeled grocery cart. Diane asked for views out all the windows, and this is not fantastic. But we're on the back of the building, and on most of these Spanish apartment buildings, you're, you're, they're built around a terrace. So you have <clears throat> windows that face that interior of the building. <clears throat> Bookshelf full of American books. Okay, we've got closet. This is where we put our winter stuff and our empty suitcases. Back out into the hall. I thought I locked this door by mistake when we first got here, but it just sticks. And the building is from the 1700s. What are you gonna do, right? And here is the downstairs bathroom. And yes, you have to walk all the way in to be able to close the door and see, okay? So, toilet, sink, shower, you know, it's, it's uh, adequate, it's got everything you need. And then, again, the view from this window. And our kitchen, okay. So it's got this nice little glass door, but you have to close it to get anything done once you're in here. Okay. So we've got in the kitchen, we have a dishwasher and we have our washing machine for our laundry. Uh, there's no dryer. You have to hang everything out to dry. Uh, double sink, four burner gas stove, oven, microwave, little rack for storage, cabinet and some drawers. Some, a lot of people were curious about the fridge. Yes, it is a decent size fridge. Um, not as big as what we'd have at home, but that's to be expected. Uh, the freezer is kind of interesting. It has drawers instead of shelves. And I just discovered this today. This is kind of fun. There's like um, things that kind of tell you how long you can leave things in the freezer. So like ice cream fish, shellfish, and... I don't know what the bottom one is, two to three. I don't know how long. Uh, so anyway, I just thought that was kind of cute. A little picture of the cow and the sheep and the cheese and the chicken. Um, one of our first trips today was to buy an espresso because Dave cannot do without his Nespresso. And so we have that set up and ready to go. Uh, 
I think it cost us about what we sold our old Nespresso for to pick that up. So we're, we're doing good there. So uh, knife block, cleaning stuff. This is a on-demand hot water heater. And then this is our living area. We've got, say hi, Dave. Hi, Dave. <laughs> so just dining table, uh, coffee table on wheels so you can move it around, sofa, a couple of bar stools, vacuum cleaner. They've painted since we saw the initial pictures because when we first looked at the apartment, this wall that I'm showing you right now was bright red and the walls in our bedroom were yellow. Um, I guess they decided in the intervening time to tone it down, but we've got like a barrel vaulted roof. We've got a ceiling fan. We have two little mini balconies, each one. So basically, I can sit at the, on the balcony and talk to Dave as he sits on the other little balcony over there. Um, so two in one plants that I'm sure I will not be able to revive. And then this is our view out of our balcony. Uh, we're pretty close to the train. So we get the train coming by every now and then, but I have already kind of started to put it out of my, like tune it out. Uh, really close to us is a brewery with a restaurant and that is their um on the on over here that is their outdoor patio so if we ever want to go sit and have a beer and some snacks we can look up at our own balcony so that is our downstairs and i will show you the upstairs tomorrow